All right, what's going on, everybody? So we are going to make a trap banger using samples on Logic Pro X. I already got the samples loaded. It's in 130. I'm going to show you how to do this. So I use this website called splice.com where you can basically, uh, I'll quick show it to you, but uh, basically splice is where, you know, you can get all these different sample packs and loops and blah, 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 and all that. So you can take a sample, like I got these two. I'll play one of them for you. Right, I like that. So you click it, you hit download. You know what I'm saying? And then you have an app on your computer. It's going to be here at the bottom or up here at the top. And this is that uh, that app. Oh, that was another one. Bam. So you drag it in to your DAW. I use Logic Pro X. Some people use other stuff. So what I'm going to do now, uh, and we're in 130, and then you just change the session, and now it look and it hits perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually sample this. So I'm going to chop it up, and then we're going to play our own version rather than just taking what's already there. That way I can throw my own creativity in there um, into the pattern and the way all that stuff goes. So, um, and I'm going to just move quick. You know what I mean, we're moving. Usually I do a lot of explaining, but I'm not doing that. Today I'm just going to make a beat. Like I just want to go in and go. You dig? So I'm going to save it. O S underscore S W V uh, and it's in D minor 130 BPM. Bet. Alright. So I'm gonna leave this the way it is. Now you probably you should chop two samples together. I should chop two samples together. I don't know what that means. Oh wait, yeah, I do. I know exactly what that means. Oh snap. Corey just gave me a great idea now that I'm looking at my IG live. I'm not going to do it right now. So I'm going to leave this the way it is, but like, just so you know, you know what I mean? But don't worry, we're not doing that yet. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to show you guys this brand new tool I just got called XO Drums. XO Drums about to blow your freaking brain off. Okay, I got to flip the IG live and show you guys about this, man. Lame. <laughs> what do you mean lame, Corey? I'm doing, I'm doing XO. So guys, this is Exo Drums. Uh, it's freaking nutty, but let me just like this is supposed to be the Galaxy. Check this though. So all the reds are kicks. I think blues are snares, hi hats. It's crazy, right? So what we're gonna do is we're gonna look, click right there, and then you're gonna be able to click through and find some drums. So I'm just gonna go to uh, we'll go Elemental Hip Hop. Now you see here it says tempo. Okay, you could change this, so don't even worry about it right now. Thinking, well, where's 130? It's like, don't even trip. Now we change it. All right, so we got our pattern, right? I don't like some of the sounds, so I could change them. Galaxies built by artificial intelligence. Okay, hey Corey, if you wanted to do it, you could do your own Instagram live. <laughs> I'm just kidding, bro. I'm kidding. Don't worry. Right? So that's kind of how it works. Um, shout out to my boy, well, JB Frolic. What's up, bro? I don't like that. I don't like this. So this pink one right here, this hat, open hat, I'm going to click edit. There it is. I'm just going to... You guys hear that? Sweet. I like it.
I'm honestly a fan. Cool. So here's what we do now. We're going to click right there. We're going to click render waves. Peep this. This is freaking nutty. I think I'll do a full on tutorial walkthrough on uh, <laughs> Juan Martin. What's up, brother? Um, now you can literally just do stems, beat as wave, or beat as MIDI. I'm going to just do all stems and I'm going to click, click create new tracks. That. Ah. Pretty cool. Now we got them. Right? So I'm going to do copy paste um and let's hear it in my opinion i think that open hat's happening way too often it's too often i just wanted it only once so i'm just going to bounce that in place really quick why did i do that i don't know why i even did that this is really what I wanted to do. Oh, okay. I see what's going on. Okay. Bounce in place. So I didn't like all those other open hats. So now when I drag it out, oh, won't let me do it. That's fine. Whatever. Boom. Just do that. Here we go. Sweet. So now. that in place with the EQ uh, we're just gonna call this sample and I'm just gonna get rid of that sweet all right um, uh, what do we do we're gonna go to arcade oh no 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 hold up we got another sample doesn't fit I don't like it I'm gonna go to arcade, check out what arcade is. This thing's freaking nuts. So arcade is a crazy VST. Um, I'm gonna set the uh, D minor. You know what I do. I'm a ginormous fan of uh, <laughs> vocal chops, but uh, I over, <laughs> I kind of overuse vocal chops. But uh, it's all right. We can just. No. Right, is this thing really in D minor? It doesn't. Things really in D minor. I'm for sure having problems with it. Well, what's the relative major? Because D minor just. 
would be minor b to six of b. Let's try let's try an F major. I think F major would be the relative major. Let's throw these in. Let's see how that's gonna sound. I want something like like dark still. I don't want no upbeat stuff, you know. Go back to D minor. I get save me. Uh, for those of you watching on YouTube right now, I'm also streaming live on Instagram literally at the same time. And so my homie Corey, who's one of my best friends, who uh, who's also, you know, he produces with me too. He just said B minor. So that could be what's messing me up. See, the sam that's what's crazy about Splice sometimes. Like the sample says D minor, but it's really, like Corey just said, we're not really in B. We're not in D minor. So he said B minor. There she goes. chop in place vocal chop bounce it in place you know what I mean this is a banger uh, I want to find some keys to throw in here let's go with arcade I mean let me play something actually Let's play something. We'll go back to this VST. I, I just found a uh, found something I like. Okay, so hold up. I found some keys that I like. Let's try that. We're in B minor, Corey said. So let's try it. So B minor, we talking about. Turn that down so you guys can hear the keys on playing. 
am I not recording that? I want to turn all the drums down. So I'm actually playing that by hand for those of you on YouTube who can't really see that I'm playing it. Oops. <laughs> Simple, let's hear that. Now in terms of melodies, that's it. We're done with melodies. Now I want to do, the last thing we're going to do is we have to find a completely, utterly, freaking banging 808. Magic, what's up, bro? I haven't seen Matt. Magic, where you been, bro? I've not seen you in a minute. Uh, we're gonna find a banging 808. I know I got one from Sunny Digital that I know I'm gonna. Oh, I could use one from Murda, but let's go Sunny. I don't know where the f you are. S. Sunny, what up, bro? Woo. All right. Um. So again. We're just going to turn everything down just so we can, just for right now, we're going to turn things down just so we can properly hear the 808 we're about to play. Just practice. simple Love it. Um, IMO this beat is done IMO means in my opinion let's do a little formatting you know what hold on that. at the end how these notes don't make it to the end neither does that cool. delete those because that one but i'm going to do a little bit more to it there's this one so i got this vst from kyle beats called drip i got it and i was like this is cool and then i was like wait this is overrated now i'm like oh wait it actually is pretty cool don't it's cool it's a good vst it's, I'm not going to go through it. Oh, I like that? Ooh. Just give it a little bit of spot. A little bit. I actually really like that a lot. Throw a little modulation on there. 
Ooh, that has that foyer to it. Just trying to time it. Ooh. Oh, a couple of notes that are just a little bit. Whoop, see ya. There we go. Do that one. Nah. I don't know what to play. Drag that out of here. I don't want to flow. Flow. Yeah, that one flows. I like the way that instrument sounds now. Let's do this. Actually, we're going to bounce this in place. Uh, I'm just going to call it. I'm just going to call it piano. I got to call in 15 minutes. <laughs> Bam. Get out of here. hear how there was a note that was messed up? Uh, hang on, there was a note that was messed up. See, this is how it goes, though. Sometimes there's going to be something messed up. Go back. Right there. We'll call it piano. We're almost done. I mean, we are done. I'm just like kind of like arranging a little bit. So I'm kind of a fan of starting songs with the uh, verses, which is usually different than what I usually do. So you don't really need to be a part of this. Um, I'll probably do this later. That's fine. Simone, what's up, bro? Oh my god, I didn't hit Command S this whole time. Uh, dark trap B D minor one thirty B three. So this is cool how that goes. So this is going to be where the hook comes in, this vocal. Um, we're going to break this down a little. Then we're going to take that away. Now, I want to show you guys a trick I use. First off, verse starts here, right? Intro, verse, and then the hook, right? I'm going to have a longer verse for second verse, but the hook, there's two things that come in that are the second, uh, that make it the hook. Number one is this. Number two, that, that open house, which I'm actually going to turn up. You guys, when, when the hook comes in, you gotta have that one instrument that's like an open hat or something that's super lively that indicates, hey, this is the hook. So like, listen to this transition.
one we had just the 808 at the end this time I'm gonna have the on youtube right now and you got any value out of this leave a rating leave a review wait that's podcast call to action uh if you're on the uh, youtube channel watching subscribe and hit the bell notification and comment below um if you're looking to get splice and you want to have some more access to all these super dope samples click below in the description you can get the uh get it through my link and uh you know i appreciate you so much for watching and i look forward to talking to you again soon peace out <laughs>